welcome to Marriage Counselor. I'm Dr. Top. This is a live show where we deal with real people and real problems. Our real couple should be joining us shortly. I hope you find it informative and helpful. Oh, excuse me. Yes, Patsy. Who's on the line? My wife? <clears throat> excuse me. <clears throat> yes, uh, well, tell her I've gone to swimming class. She'll believe that. What? Well, I, I don't care. You make something up. It doesn't matter. Yes. Who's here? Oh, Mrs. Uh, mm -hmm. Send her in. And uh, <clears throat> I'll see you later, you little tart. <laughs> oh. That should be our real couple right now. Oh, hello. Dr. Top. You must be Mrs. Tender. Yes, I am. How do you do? Fine, fine. Uh, Mr. Tender, is he here too? No, he refused to come. He denies that there's a problem in our marriage and he wouldn't even come here and discuss it. I think that proves there's a problem, don't you? Well, that proves something anyway. I'm not sure what. Yes. Huh. Well, we like to begin these counseling sessions by having both spouses present, so I... I no, that would be best, Doctor, but I know exactly what he'd say if he was here, so I'll speak for both of us. He'd be sitting here. he be that close. All right. Well, why don't we start by getting on a first name informal basis? Oh, good. My name is Margaret. My husband's name is Bob. No, it's Jack. That's what he'd say. Oh, he would, would he? Yes, he would. His name is Bob, but he's into calling himself Jack for some odd reason. I don't know. <laughs> I see. Well, uh, what should I call him? You can call him Vomit. All right. Well, how long have you and the Vomit been aware that there's a problem in your marriage? Oh, I'd say it was, uh... Since the wedding. <laughs> oh, don't be so funny. If you're not going to behave yourself, there's no sense in being here. Well, he isn't here. Oh, I am so. Then speak up. He's here. All right, uh, look, do you have any children? No, we don't have any children. She can't have them. Yes, I can. No, you can't. Yes, I can, so have children. All right, Bob, I think they're a little... Jack. All right, Jack. His name is Bob. All right, then Bob. Jack. Then Jack. Bob. All right, Bob, Jack. then. All right, Jack. Bob. All right, look, look. You, you seem to know what your husband would say. Why don't you assume the role of your husband, and I'll play you and me. Oh, well, that'd be a lot easier on me, too. Thank you. Good. So then I'll be playing my husband. That's right. I'll be speaking in a slightly lower voice to indicate myself. That's fine. Now, the problem then would seem to be sexually oriented, so why don't we talk about that? Uh, why don't we talk about something she knows about? <laughs> sex? I know about sex. I know that before we were married, I wouldn't sleep with him, and now that we are, he won't sleep with me. Oh, come on, who'd want to sleep with an old carp face like you, would you? <laughs> well, I, I don't know that I come would. Come on, tell the truth. Yes, would you or would you? Well, I don't really know that I... Come on, would you or would you? Well, I, I, I'm not really sure. Well, you would, you would, wouldn't you? Well, I, I think I would, I guess. You would? Well, I, I don't really... Come on, would you? Well, I don't... Well, you would, would you? I, I don't really... What? What? what, what, what oh, who the hell am I? Listen, I, I think your answer's a lot better than your questions. Why don't I ask all the questions, you give all the answers, and I'll go home and discuss with my husband. All right, fine. Then I'll be playing uh, you and your husband. Yes, and I'll play you. All right. All right. Uh, now, Mr. and Mrs. Tender, it would seem obvious to me that you two are not sexually attracted to each other. Well, I'm sexually attracted to myself. <laughs> Mr. Tender, please, I don't think you're saying much for your wife. I think your wife is a very, very lovely woman. Well, thank you very much. Yes, you are. And, Mrs. Tender, I don't think this marriage is your fault. I think there's somebody else involved. You do? Yes, I do. Now, Mrs. Tender, think carefully. Have you ever had any extramarital affairs? Well, I haven't had any affairs per se. Good. Per se? What the hell is this, a Latin class? Give me a break. <laughs> Mr. Tender, please. Mr. Tender, now listen, your wife was only trying to answer honestly. Now, how about you doing the same for a change? All right. Mr. Tender, are you having any extramarital affairs? Well, yes, I am. You are? Ah, I just said that to bug you. Oh, no, I know you are. Ah, oh, shut up, will you? No, 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 no. Shut up. Mr. Tender, please. Oh, 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 Mrs. Tender. Mrs. Tender, are you all right? Yes, I am. Get Mr. Tender, how dare you treat your wife like that? Mr. Tender. What? Miss, what? Mr. Yes. Tender. Are you or are you not having any extramarital affairs? No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. Oh, yes, he is having affairs. I happen to know. Uh, oh, yes, he is having. Oh, get out of the way. You're not doing this right. Are you having an affair or aren't you? Yes, I am. I know you were. I knew too. I just wanted you to find out who you had an affair with. I'm not going to tell you. You're not going to tell you. Come on, tell your wife. Tell me. Look, it's my secretary. <gasps> your husband, your secretary. How could you? He's such a lovely wife. Thank you very much. My secretary puts out. <gasps> your secretary. I'm not supposed to use I can tell you. He's well, what's wrong with having an affair with your secretary? Sometimes she's the only person you can trust. You can count on her. She's not like the old bat at home who just takes, takes, takes and never gives. Oh, <laughs> 
Well, you're just like everyone else. Thank you very much. Nobody ever sees my side of the marriage. Well, I'll seek counsel somewhere else. Thank you very much, you curb face. Well, that concludes Marriage Counselor for today. I hope you found it... See what I have to live with? Uh, I hope you found it informed. Come on, let's go for a drink. Okay. We're gonna go for a drink and we'll see you later. Come on, let's go. Okay. Who's gonna pay? You pay. <laughs>